Hey guys, Rochelle here with Amethyst Ascension. So today I'm going to be doing a VR to um, Robin over at Toadstool Tarot. Um, and it is, I don't have it in front of me. I think it's three, um, three card selfie. And I seen it first over on Dee's channel, Divination's channel. So I'll be putting a link to both of those channels down below. So please go and check them out. But I thought it was kind of, you know, a fun little uh, VR to be doing. Um, and hopefully get some introspection. So the card that I chose for this time, there's a few different cards um, that I usually relate with depending on what's going on. Um, one is the Queen of Pentacles because I am a Capricorn. One is the Queen of Cups because according to my Myers-Briggs personality test, I am a Queen of Cups. Um, and well, I'm a Queen of Cups based on the fact that I'm an INFJ, uh, personality type. Um, also one of them sometimes that when I feel like my intuition is where it should be. Um, and also wanting to always learn more about my intuition and my psychic development and stuff like that. I will do the high priestess. Um, however, right now, I honestly feel like the fool. <laughs> and what I mean by that is the fool is one of my favorite cards in the tarot because I believe that the fool which I'm going to be using the Bone Stone and Earth Flesh Tarot. Um, but I believe that the Fool is all about experiencing, right? And with the climate that we are in right now around the world, I feel like I just need to sit back, soak in as much as I can, learn as much as I can, which I'm, I'm always trying to learn. But, you know, it's like, I mean, it feels like a lot of people have gone apeshit crazy, <laughs> including myself on some days. So I felt like the fool. Okay. So essentially what you do is you shuffle the cards and you take the card that is before it and the card that is after your significator. And the fool would be my significator in this situation. So you just gotta shuffle. Oops. I love these cards. Bear with me, guys. I probably should have shuffled beforehand, but I wasn't thinking. There's that fool energy again, right? <laughs> find the fool. And this, I mean, it's just pretty much a snapshot of what's going on with me right now. My goodness. Watch me go through the entire deck. Maybe I didn't shuffle it good enough because it was in the front. Oh my goodness gracious. Yep, it was. Okay, so I'll take that one, that one, and the very first one that was on the top. 
which was that one. So that would be behind it. Okay. Uh, let me see if you can see that. Let me try to get in a little bit closer. Sorry, guys. All right, let's see. Hmm. What do we have here? Three of Pentacles. Hmm. So, the way I see it right now is to still trust my intuition. Obviously, the fool is about taking that journey, learning the lessons that I need to learn, and being whatever energy I need to be in any given moment um, in order to learn whatever valuable lessons I need to learn on my journey, my path. But also, always remember to be a team player, you know. Um, not think of just myself, but think of other people and join in on um, you know, community, be a member of the community, join in with other like-minded individuals in order to help me along my, my path. So that's what I see there. So I hope you have enjoyed this and I hope you check out the other people that are doing this. And I hope that, uh, you do this as well. And I am sending you love and light. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.